Hey, what's up? This is Justin with wingsound.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to organize your sessions better using the show and hide function in Pro Tools 8. Check it out. To get to your track list, what you want to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner, this little arrow right here. Click on it, and there's your track list. So, you know, when you get a big session, there's going to be a lot of tracks, and it could get confusing during mixing. So, what you might want to do is hide some tracks. So, first way to hide tracks is you can right click on it and choose hide or you can just click on these little gray dots right here and then it's hidden now bring it back just click back on it again see now when you hide a track it's not going to show up over here in your edit window but it's still going to play even though it's not showing so now if you want to mix something and you don't want to hear it here are the other tracks that you're hiding. What you want to do is you right click on it and then choose hide and make inactive. So this way you won't hear it. You, won't, you don't have to go in and mute the track and then go hide it. It's just a lot faster. So let's just say I want to edit all my drum tracks. So to choose a selection to hide, you can click on, click on one to hide it and then hold it and then drag your mouse up. And as you can see, they're going away, they're hidden. And then you let it go and then they become hidden now to get them back click on it again and then drag your mouse down and they'll come back but like i said they're still going to play so what you want to do is click on your top one then hold shift and then click on the bottom one so now all these are highlighted so what you want to do to hide and make inactive to a selective amount of tracks you want to do shift option then right click and then hide and make inactive so as you can see, they're all gone. <clears throat> and they're, the, the track names are italicized to show you that they're in, inactive. So now you got your drums here and you know you can mix up your drums without having to worry about your other tracks. So as you can see, it's just the, the drums. Now to get them back, you wanna do the same thing. Click on your the top one and then the bottom hold shift right click and then show and make active and now they're all back so now whatever you do in the edit window also happens in the mix window as well so the same thing to get your track list you go to this little arrow in the bottom left hand corner and there they are so I'll show you in both windows I'm gonna do the same thing I just want my drums so shift you know to highlight a select selected area right click shift option hide and make inactive so it does it to all that as you can see both windows there they're hidden and they're inactive so now you can mix your drums and get your you know good drum mix and then bring all your tracks back and mix the rest of them together and get a great mix you can always get in touch with justin at wingsound.com and check out more of justin's videos including these titles featuring the new pro tools 8 now available on demand at wingsound.com